Hello, welcome back to the Snow Bros Gaming Channel. We've got some more Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator for you today, and this particular battle has come at a request from Kurt. I'm not going to say which one it is yet, though. We're just going to jump right in and get the battle going. The human forces have cornered a group of bandits that have been terrorizing the lands and are now charging in to deal the final blow. The spearmen, footmen, heavy knights, and archers battling against the bandit horde that have been trapped up against this hillside. Forces charge in towards each other. The battle lines are formed, but the bandits are just wearing normal clothes and an axe. No match for a professional army. Spearmen, footmen, heavy knights, heavily armored, backed up with archers for support. How can the bandits possibly stand up to this? Slowly but surely. They just start whittling away at each other. Advantage, though? Professional army. Or so you would think. Arrows flying overhead. The bandits trying to get a bit of a circle on them, using their numbers to their advantage. But it's not going to be enough. Heavy knights holding the flank. No chance. More pretty patterns forming. Wait, what's that up in the hill? Is that a necromancer? Why is he... Oh, God. He's revived a zombie horde. They're approaching from behind our lines. If they hit these archers, they're just glass cannons. They're going to turn the whole horde. They're going to turn the whole group of archers against us. In which case, we might lose this battle. Get the zombies. The zombie lines are getting closer and closer. We need to grab some trips and send them back. Go back. Defend the archers. Charge! Oh god, the deaths have already started. They're already turning them into other zombies. It's the necromancer stands up on that hillside watching and laughing, probably. Charge! Stop the zombies! God, this horde is just gonna swell in numbers. If they're able to beat us here, they're gonna be able to use all of those corpses to raise a whole new brand, a brand new undead army. We must stop them here. We need more men. We can't pull too many off, we're gonna lose against the bandits. But the zombies, they must be stopped. Pull off the line. Go. Charge. Oh god, the bandits though, they're starting to overwhelm us. The bandits have broken through. So we pulled off there. Oh. Crap. The zombie horde swells in number. Uh oh. If they get these bandits, there's gonna be so many zombies. Damn it. Zombies just creeping through the troops, converting them all. There's now 900 zombies there. God knows what's going to happen once they hit the bandit lines. The bandits aren't going to be able to hold them. Uh oh. The bandits are too busy trying to finish off the heavy knights. Instead of banding together to beat a common foe. The necromancer just stands up there watching. Here we go. The bandits have engaged. How will they fare against the zombies? Or will they just cause their numbers to swell? 
to unstoppable heights. Here we go. No, nope. it's as I feared. The bandits are no match. The bandits' numbers are dropping and the zombies' numbers are growing. What can they do against this? If only we'd saw it coming. Now, with these fresh zombie numbers, these corpses the necromancer can raise from the dead. We're gonna have a new undead army right on our doorstep. Not good. Not good at all. There we have it. The Soul Tyrant has his brand new army. We're coming for you. Thank you all for joining me. Hit that subscribe button for daily notifications of my daily video uploads. And hit that like button. Appreciate it so much, and it helps beyond belief. And leave a comment below if you have any suggestions of your own, like Kurt and Jeff. Keep helping out with ideas. But yeah, thank you all for joining me, and I'll hopefully see you in the next episode. God knows what's going to happen next. Bye.